Hey guys, Common Builders here, and welcome back to Let's Play Kingsville 2. We are here at the Wind Shrine, I think it's called. Um, we spent all of last episode here exploring this place. It's a pretty good sized place. So in today's episode, now that we have uh, uh, unsealed uh, the place, we can now get all the treasure out of it. So there's a lot of treasure to get, so we're going to have to go back and carefully get everything. Ooh, whoa. I've forgotten about this thing. Uh, somehow I think it helps with our wind magic or something. We're going to go ahead and uh, equip it for sure. Oh yeah, it brings our wind magic up to 97. It wasn't at 97 before. <laughs> really cool. That means our wind magic is even more powerful. <coughs> so, where were we? Um, let's see here. Uh, so which way to go first? I guess we'll go left over here real quick. I don't think there's. I don't know. <laughs> okay, there's a treasure chest over here. Ooh, wind crystal, nice. Well, let's go ahead and use that. I definitely want to be using wind magic because there's some cool spells you can learn uh, with wind magic, so I'm definitely going to be training up on that. Uh, let's go over here. There's another chest over here. Now, of course, not all the chests are going to contain something awesome, but, you know, that's how these games go. Sometimes the treasure's good, sometimes it's not. Just like in a lot of different RPG-type games. So I guess we'll go left over here first can't remember where all the treasure is at so there's nothing in that room and as you can see all the monsters are now gone <clears throat> okay there's that a treasure in here whoa a verdite crystal well we'll definitely use that is it not yeah magic Power of high level mages have been sealed inside this gem. But I will increase all areas of magical power. Nice. Well, definitely use that. No magic spells learned yet, though, but that's okay. Let's see here. Uh, now I need to head. Actually, I'm going to go around and see if there's anything over here. Want to check every room to make sure. Okay, there's a save point there. So this wing is complete. Let's see. All right, sorry. <laughs> I'm trying to go too fast. But I want to go ahead and get uh, the looting done this episode because I spent quite a bit of time in last episode. Um, making our way through the labyrinth and uh, just trying to find our way to the place we needed to be to learn our uh, wind magic. Well, bloodstone, we had to use a few bloodstones fighting the different creatures in here, the, the ones that uh, attack you with the scythe and cast paralysis magic, which is really cheap by the way. Oh, there's another one. Well, I'm not worried about you. So I guess, I, yeah, I guess the monsters do end up respawning, but that's okay. Okay, there's a chest in here. A uh, moonstone, well, we'll have them in case we need them. So let's see here. Yeah, now we need to go to the middle part. Just gonna avoid these guys for now. Well, yeah, there we go. 
because I don't want to spend all episode just looting this place because uh, still got a lot of places to go um, let's see here now we'll go to the middle part which will be real really quick because there's only two rooms in this part on each side so it won't take very long at all to complete Let's see here. Um, yeah, there's a treasure chest here. Let's just try to get this real quick. And it's a bloodstone. So it's good we're recovering some bloodstones that we had to use. Because those are really a lifesaver in situations where you get paralyzed. Yeah, it really helps. So. Let's go up here and hopefully we will find something good in this chest. Hopefully there's another good chest. We did find that one nice uh, amulet or whatever, necklace I think it was, yeah. Another moonstone. Let's see here. Anything over here? Yeah, nothing. Just more of those guys. I don't know, like, if this Kingsville game is like the other one where there's certain weapons you might be able to find by killing certain enemies, but uh, I never did um, in the last Kingsville Let's Play I do. There's a certain kind of sword you can get that you that you kill a certain enemy and they uh, will drop. A certain type of weapon that's actually kind of rare in the game because uh, it, it's the only place in the game where you can get it and it's kind of rare and hard to get but it does make me wonder you know where if there might be such a weapon I'll have to do some studying about this game and if there is I'm gonna try to I try I need to try to do it while I'm actually doing this let's play and see if there's actually certain swords in the game that I haven't even discovered yet. So, because they're this game, they made this game even bigger than the first Kingsfield. Well, you know, the first Kingsfield I played, anyway. I'm just gonna, yeah, the original Kingsfield, that's right. I forgot. Yeah, the Wind Crystal. So, I'm just gonna start calling Kingsfield, Kingsfield 1, and Kingsfield 2, Kingsfield 2, and stuff. So, I won't get them confused, and the original Kingsfield, I'll just call the original Kingsfield, which was only released in Japan. But there, I do have uh, the ROM, which is uh, translated, actually, and eventually I will definitely come back and do a Let's Play of it. So, okay, did I check that other room? That's the question. I don't know. We'll go check it real quick, just in case there's something good. And, okay, there's just a save point. Um, we'll definitely hit a save point up here in a little while, but for now, let's see, yeah, okay, just double checking rooms and stuff, just because I don't want to pass up anything, I'm pretty sure I went here, but just double checking, oh no, I didn't. Well, okay, a moonstone. That's another moonstone I didn't have, so why not? Okay, and then the last uh, wing, I guess you could say. Then we can uh, head out of here and uh, be on our merry way to the next part of the game, which I'm not really sure exactly where we need to go, but I'm thinking about maybe heading back to that one labyrinth and uh, seeing where it might take us. Ooh, another Verdite crystal. That's beautiful. I remember the Verdite crystals in Kingsfield 1. You could actually buy them, but they were like, ooh, they were like really expensive. <laughs> 
Ooh, missile shield, huh? That's a wind magic. Uh, I think the next spell we, we'll learn, you'll, we'll be able to uh, freeze enemies with it, which is one of my favorite ones. And it's really powerful, too. So let's see. Let's go see it. Uh, there's got to be at least one more treasure around this way somewhere, which may not contain nothing special, but we'll go ahead and get it for the sake of the video. Ooh, wow, nice. So, like the gauntlets I'm wearing, which are Raijin, I guess that's how you pronounce it, Raijin or something. Uh, uh, now we have uh, the Fujian boots, which is part of the set. So it's almost like some kind of samurai armor or something, kind of cool. And there's a sword that goes along with it too, which I would like to get because it's a really neat sword. So let's go down here just in case I don't think there's any treasure down here. Ugh. Let's see here. Uh, yeah. Probably the last treasure, but we'll check that other room just in case. So we got back just about all the bloodstones that we had to use, so that's good. That is very good. Okay, that's uh, everything. So, with that, we'll go ahead and use our uh, Icarus... Uh, Actually, we'll use the wings. Because I want to head back to that labyrinth again. And kind of explore in that area. And of course, with uh, every teleportation, there's a conveniently placed gold fountain. Let's see here. Crystal flask. There we go, all three gold potions. Hopefully we'll find more... Well, we will eventually find more crystal flask, but yeah. Uh, we also need to find another Orladen's uh, pick so we can uh, free up this man-eater and kill it because behind the man-eater is a path to another area. So we'll definitely have to uh, keep that in mind. I do think I have to... Is there not another way around? No, I have to go through this house again. Yeah. Try to avoid being cursed if I can. All right. But this will not be as far away from that labyrinth as the other place that the Icarus uh, eye will take you. So let's go ahead. We need to head. Uh, see well it looks like there's no monsters over here now I bet Lord Varak took care of them well that's cool so um yeah I don't know if there's any more treasure over here or not but uh if we go across this bridge over here we can uh, head back to that labyrinth and we will be able to uh, do a little more exploration. I think there's one more... Uh, let's see if we could... I just want to go talk to Lord Bayrek one more time because we want to do it periodically because uh, uh, certain things uh, as you progress in the game uh, you will get more options and dialogue, so. Yeah, like here. While I was standing here as a stone statue, I witnessed countless villagers being killed and eaten by those wicked demons. 
but what of my vengeance now? Killing the king won't bring back, bring back the death. I suppose that the least I can do is to to ensure that these children have the future that has been that was taken from so many at the hand of all the wickedness. While I'm alive, I'd like to see peace in this country again. Until peace returns, I shall make sure that these children are safe. Let's all pray that we shall have peace again soon. Okay. So right now, since uh, Lord Vayrak is uh, alive with us and not turned to stone, <laughs> uh, uh, there won't be any monsters around here. So, of course, he's not going to be turned back to stone again, hopefully. Anyway. Let's say there was something around here. But I do not remember where. Although I don't think there's anything in these houses. But I don't remember checking this one. Yeah, I did. Yeah, I did. Never mind. But I think we've got most of the treasure out of this place except maybe here I didn't even recognize this chest got a hundred gold very good oh well, let's go ahead and speak to this little girl I bet her sister has returned home now a while back Lord Vayrak chased off the scary monsters and things we're a little better for a while, but my sister and I were still sad. It's very lonely here without anyone else in the village. My sister said that the people would come back again, though, and she told me that I'd be able to play with the other kids again soon. I wish they'd all hurry up and come back. Are you going to stay here with us? We're all alone out here now. Uh, you know about what happened to Lord Varak, right? I was just going over there to where he was. I wish they'd all hurry up. Okay, yeah. So that's all she has to say. Wonder what she's planning. We'll never know. <laughs> uh, so anyway, let's talk to this lady again. Lord Vayrak has done so much for us. Thank you so much for your help. I think he's going to be okay now. You really are here to help us. Thank you for saving Lord Varak. I really appreciate what you've done. Lord Varak is all better now, and the evil creatures in this area are gone too. You have given us hope. Oh, yeah. Ooh, hello, hello. Hmm. But what are the other villagers? It's uh, been very desolate here since the horrific incident 10 years ago. Nothing but tragedy has taken place. So much pain. Perhaps you will give them hope too. I wish we could have peace soon. Well, me too. But it's going to be a while. <laughs> um, let's see here. Wow, another Aladdin's pick. So, only thing is, the area that we could go to might be too dangerous for us right now. So we may not go there just yet, but we do have a, a, a labyrinth to go to for sure. And it may take us to another area. I don't know why I keep checking this part right here, but whatever. I guess I think there's treasure there when there's probably not, apparently not. So let's head back into this uh, labyrinth because um, it will take us to another area. And we'll see what that area may have in store for us. So, let me get out my map. So, let's see. Well, there's a pathway going to the left over here. Let's see what this takes us. Let's see, yeah, okay, I remember this place. Let's kill these ghosts in here, because uh, they're bad news all around. 
Let's get rid of Capricorn. We'll equip this one again. All right. Well. There we go. And uh, what do we have here? An empty barrel. We got some more morning star thingies. Ooh. Uh, let's see if we can do this without dying. Let's see here. There's a chest there too. Okay, this is risky business, <laughs> but I don't know if there's a switch on the other side, so we're going to have to carefully do this. Okay, here we go. Oh, gosh, you scared the crap out of me. Oh, man. Oh, ouch. You hurt. But this hurts too, doesn't it? I have to take it because uh, those traps hurt even worse. So, yeah. Get my not worth it herbal liquid. <laughs> okay, it's, hopefully there's a switch. Nope, no switch. Ooh, I hear bad monsters. I don't know if I'm ready to fight these guys. But we'll give it a shot. I didn't think it would take us over here. Oh, there's a switch. Ouch. Ooh, yeah, that magic hurts. No, oh, easy. Keep our sword equipped while we fight these things. Hopefully they drop something good. Ow, man, ow. Careful, careful. I don't know what type of uh, thing they're weak against. Got Capricorn out. I think we'll get this one out just in case. Need to save my magic up for that. Well, at least it doesn't curse us or anything. They just crystals of pain, is what they are. Woo. Man, they are they are powerful. Let's just hit the switch and. Uh, okay, I think I did. Whoa. Okay, that's yeah, that's a uh, pathway to death. So <laughs> we're not going that way. But it may take us somewhere later on. So anyway. Let's go back into the grid here and heal ourselves first. Uh guess we'll go. Guess we'll go left and see what's over here. I did kind of look over here a while ago. Uh, didn't go to the left here too. I guess there wasn't anything important. Okay, that leads us back to where those guys were. Is there a secret door maybe? Oh man, they're already trying to kill us. Uh, let's see. I'm going to go ahead and use another gold potion to keep my magic up. Well, hello. Okay, got that taken care of. So, let's see here. Okay, I guess we'll go back down this way then. Uh, 
All right, so let's go here and uh, we'll see what awaits us. Probably need to get out my Capricorn because it's. Uh, I think there's a lot of skellies in this place, so we'll be ready to fight those guys. It's been a while since I've been in here. But I have done a playthrough not too awful long ago. Oh, really? Ooh. No. Oh, okay, no. Uh, I'm just going to run. Oh, gosh. Nowhere to run. Nowhere to run. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, there's someone here. I forgot about that. No, no, no. Three of them at once. No, thank you. Not good. Not good. Oh, oh man. That was something else. Well, shoot. Uh, that way's going to lead us to nowhere. Uh, oh, hmm. well, did I miss something? There's that. Hmm. Go left again. Oh yeah, that's right. When we first started out here, we only went this way, so... Which took us to this area with the trap, and uh, yeah, okay, now I remember. So, now that that's done, let's go ahead and see what's over here. Let's see here, I do hear stuff. Yeah, there's rooms and stuff in here. Treasure, and there's going to be skeletons in here, I bet. I bet inside these things, right? Ooh, poison. That one's locked, probably with the... Uh, uh, probably copper key. Okay, how about silver key? Okay, how about copper key? Okay. Bloodstone. And empty. You're empty too, right? Probably. Yep. Well, what is down here? Whoa, spikes. Spikes, no good. All right. Yeah, I thought so. <laughs> Man, that's got a reach on it. Whoa. Ah, of course. Just a bunch of trap chests. thinking we probably need to go back and use that or Aladdin's pick and go to that other area. I just thought it might be too dangerous, but I don't know if we're where this is going to take us. <laughs> I 
No secrets. Uh, let's see here. Oh, okay. There's a room over here, or no? Oh, but there's a pathway that way, okay, huh? long on this episode, but I'm going to try to get back and see what's in here real quick. So that's there, I guess. So that it might be secret doors, but I'm gonna say maybe. Nah, probably not. Although it's possible there could be one here, but I don't think so. Nah. Yeah, there's not gonna. I don't think anyway. I'll double check. Yeah, nothing. So, let's try this other room real quick. With some more skeletons. What else? Oh, I don't know. I don't know. Oh. oh, boy. Well, it just keeps going and going, doesn't it? Well, probably going to have to end it here. And uh, we'll continue here in uh, next episode. So anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see y'all in the next one.